Hey, Team Freedom, it's Tony Hughes. I just wanted to do a quick little, I'll call it a training video, uh, really just focusing on what we can do to help our colleagues at some of our competition in terms of increasing their net worth and their income. So just want to go over a quick little uh, whiteboard here example just to help, especially some of the newer agents that maybe don't quite catch the vision yet of why revenue share is just as important um, as our real estate income business, because that's what's going to keep coming in, whether we're selling houses or not. So if I can get this little camera turned around up here, hopefully you guys can see this okay. It's kind of my chicken scratch. but um, So basically, we've got EXP Realty here in this column, Keller Williams, Cobble Banker, Remax, Century 21, Berkshire Hathaway. And I could go on and on with you know other competitors, but... Starting off, you know, the one benefit that we have here is that 80-20 split, you know, and a lot of agents don't really sit down to do the math on that with their calculator, but you sell a, you know, a $333,000 home at 3%, that's a $10,000 gross commission, 80% of that is $8,000. Now, if you're with Keller Williams, Cobble Banker, Remax, Century 21, or Berkshire Hathaway, or many other uh, big name brokerages, you're gonna be at a 70-30 split. That means of that 10,000, you're only gonna take home 7,000. So what does that translate to for us? More cash flow when we're with EXP because of our 80-20 split, as opposed to all of our competition's old model of 70-30 split. But it gets worse for our competition because they're not really at a 70-30 split. They're really at about a 64, uh, what is that, a 64-26% split? because, or yeah, because they're, uh, I probably got the math wrong on that, but basically they're at 6% less of that, right? They're at a 64% split, not a 70% split. So that's even worse for their cash flow. They're gonna take home less income because they've gotta pay out 6% on top of the 70% split to their brokerage. Same with Cobalt Banker, their, their uh, franchise fees are anywhere from six to 8%. Same with Remax, Century 21, Berkshire Hathaway, I believe is a little bit more. Um, so from a cash flow perspective, EXP clearly has all of these competitors beat. Now look at the stock. We get 5% of our commission put into the stock at a 10% discount if we are opted into our agent equity program, which I hope all of you are. It's a built-in savings plan. You're, you, you really should be on that program. If you're not, you have no idea what you're missing out on. Uh, when it comes to potential future earnings, but they, we have stock. They don't, they don't, they don't, they don't, they don't. So no one else gets equity in their brokerage. We get equity. That's a huge difference between eXp Realty and all the other competitors is there is no equity with our competition. You don't own any of that brokerage. And if you're going to be selling houses, why not sell houses for a company that gives you equity in the company? Revenue share, we share 50% of our monthly revenue to agents that bring producing agents to EXP. They get no rev share at KW, no rev share at Cobalt Banker, none at Remax, none at Century 21, none at Berkshire Hathaway and many others, right? So no other company out there is sharing 50% of their monthly revenue to agents that are helping to grow the company vis-a-vis -vis agent attraction, right? Quarterly dividends, we get four cents four cent per share dividend every quarter. I got a little check, you know, a couple months ago and I had to call in the EXP because I had no idea what it was for. It was like 285 bucks and they said, oh, that was your dividend check. You know, we don't get, you don't get that at, at the competition because they're all privately held or they're publicly traded, but they don't give their agents any sort of equity in the company. So quarterly dividends, uh, we have over 80 hours a week of live training. Over 80 hours a week, there's less training at all of our competition. They simply do not have the ability to provide that level of training to their agent base. They just have too many, too much overhead, uh, too many expenses, and they just can't, they can't afford it, frankly. Um, so here's another big reason why, why eXp is so much better virtual, right? We have a virtual platform. We don't have to spend all that money on gas. Who knew gas was gonna be $5 a gallon, right? Uh, you know, a couple years ago. So the virtual platform allows us to be far more efficient than our competition, and it allows us to save additional cost. And we could go on and on. We've got a mentor program here where you could generate a really nice income being a mentor once you qualify for that. That's another income source that we have here at eXp. 
um, and, and the list goes on and on. So just want to share that with you guys. Hope that's helpful. Have a great day. We'll talk to you soon. Bye-bye.